Hello again. Um, just wanted to show this new toy that I've got, which is a Gigabyte Gaming Bricks, which has an AMD quad core processor and a dedicated AMD GPU. I've installed the item comes bare bones, so you have to install a hard drive, RAM, and an operating system. So We've got an SSD in there and a 500 gig hard drive and 12 gig of Crucial Ballistics RAM. And uh, I had a key for Windows uh, 8, so we've upgraded it to Windows 10 now. And I've got Tomb Raider running on it at the moment. <clears throat> I'm about to have a go with a benchmark, so... I'll just load that up and we'll see uh, how many frames per second. Uh, the benchmark runs on. Now it is uh, on a lower setting, it's not on uh, ultra setting as you can imagine. And Aliasing is turned off, AA is turned off because that will cripple something of uh, this spec. But as you can see, graphically, it looks pretty, uh, pretty impressive. And it is 1920 by 1080. I haven't changed the resolution, just the quality settings. Hopefully the image won't flicker too much. It's picking up the uh, flickering from the plasma screen. And let's see what we come up with. So, that's actually pretty impressive. Now that is on a quite a low uh, setting, but that means in game it's going to be very playable so you will be looking at uh, I reckon a good 40 frames 50 frames per second for gameplay so yeah that's pretty impressive uh, I might do one other benchmark so bear with me okay we're back again we're running uh, Dirt 3 the uh, benchmark within the game uh, it's 1920 by 1080 and we're running on a lower setting preset. As you can see the game still looks very good. It's running very smoothly. But it will be interesting to see uh, what the results are at the end of the benchmark. Okay, hopefully it won't be too long now. I believe it's just round the corner and we should get our results. Okay, what are the results? 44 frames per second average 63 so that's pretty good and there's the unit and as you can hear the fans have ramped up definitely not a unit to be put in on your desk but in a living room across the room with the speakers on it's actually not too bad at all cheers for now